Hi guys, welcome back to another episode of Practice with Yola, where I review my own crystal fights and try to identify what I've done well and what could improve on. If you enjoy such content, subscribe. Don't hesitate to connect with me through comments if you have any ideas you'd like to share. Without further ado, let's begin with our first fight. So I did well with trying to kill F as much as I can, but not gonna lie, our team is kinda in shambles. Our front line and back line is basically together. I can't see the front line anywhere. And our why is the frost stuff there? Yeah, so we're fighting on all fronts, so that's not good already. Okay, that's a good kill there. Yeah, I should have I should have grave guarded him there, but And I should have no, that was a wrong grave guard. I totally should have used my E and Qs to get him up. And because of that that I grave guarded him, another melee die. So now we're being forced to push back. Grave guards should always be used in the only in only the most dire situations. Okay, we're pushing them back, that's good. I should try to kill. Yes, try to kill the front line before you try to kill the back line. Hmm, the back line is a bit too close to the front line. Okay, the two, the two range are too clump, and I shouldn't be trying to clump on them as well. Hmm, I'm way too far from the front line. Okay, that's a good. I should use E as as I can. Uh, okay, I should use E. Uh, I didn't. I don't know why I didn't use E, and I don't know why I didn't grave guard. I should have used grave guard. Uh, that melee die for nothing. Hmm. <laughs> yes. Okay. Try to kill. Yes. Okay. Well. Should have used grave guard there. Again. Not sure what I was thinking. <laughs> okay, try to save the E for the front. Yes, try to see the front. Yes, try to save the front. And, and yeah, I should have not used Graveguard for people that are coming back. See, again. I should not be using Grave Guard for people that are coming back into the camp that are already safe from enemy, safe from any damage, so mm, yeah that was a bad Grave Guard just now. I should be using E here. Okay, okay. <laughs> uh I mean why typed is also true. <laughs> the backline is to taking a lot of damage. Perhaps because of a non existent frontline. Okay, try to kill the melee as he goes in, that's good. I why am I there? I shouldn't be there. Okay. Um yeah, I shouldn't be there. I'm way too far from my back line. Yeah. See. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah, because of because I'm using my E's and Grave Guards at the wrong time, I'm costing our our fights basically. This video is a really good, really really good. Uh, this video is a good video for learning all the mistakes that you should be avoiding. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm glad that I'm not using. Yeah, I. Hmm, I didn't use E again. I should have used E for him. I'm not sure what I'm doing there. Alright, managed to get one kill. That's good. And why did our 
<laughs> Why did our backline run all the way up? That was wrong. Hi, <laughs> yeah. I'm surprised he survived, but that was wrong. I'm wasting too much heals on our backline. Our frontline needs to heal more. To put more pressure. And I shouldn't be using Breeze. I'm so glad I'm out of Breeze. Now I'm using more. I'm using more Pawn now. That's good. This video isn't dated today. It's, uh, <laughs> this video has been taken like a few days ago. I was just lazy to cut it. So. <laughs> Okay, I should be using my E. I'm not sure why I'm not using my E. Should be using my E for the front line at least. Come on. Yeah, definitely E myself. <laughs> yeah, I feel like I E myself way too late there, and I didn't manage to E the front line. So that was yeah, that was basically the faults. Many many mistakes, many wrong E's and wrong grave guards. So yeah, let's move on to the next fight. Hopefully it's better. Alright, let's check out our second fight. Mm, yes, okay, there we go. Start queuing the front line, that's good. Why is our back line in the front? Continue kiting backwards, that's good, but I'm I'm stacking on them too much. I'm stacking on them way too much and still stacking too much. Uh, I should be Graveguard? Graveguard? Okay. <laughs> that was way too close for <laughs> that was way too close. Oh Okay. Okay. <laughs> Okay, well at least I got a kill. <laughs> That's not bad, I guess. <laughs> um, yes, E him, correct. Okay. Uh, hmm, I, uh, I definitely should be using pawn more. Now I can totally see the value of pawn. And I shouldn't be walking over him there. Yeah, still stacking. That's not good. Still too close. Mm, too close. Okay, way too close. No, I should be this close. Yeah, see? If I'm way too close to the front line or way too close to any of them, I will very easily just get stacked. And they can just root us, snare us, and then deal tons of damage. We're just lucky that there's no tank in this fight. Yeah. Okay, I should be using E on him. I didn't. I mean, okay. And I'm not sure why I stopped queuing, but that's a no go. <laughs> I should be queuing at all times. Gotta practice the muscle memory then. <laughs> hmm. Bad position, but okay, since there's no one there. Okay, yes, kill the melee. Where's he, where's he going? Okay. Ah, uh, yes. So lucky him, I was there, but <laughs> could have died. Oh. <laughs> I saw what that Kurskal did there, but okay, that's a good one. Okay, hmm, yes, okay. I think I should be up there, not here, but okay, E, yes. Unfortunate. Hmm. I should be up there, not at the side here, but it's okay. E. Ah, I'm about to die. Hmm. Yes. That's good, that's good, that's good. I can, yeah, I mean, it's a good thing that I'm trying to save my E for any fights that come down. That's good, that's good. Always try to save the E for the front line. Yes, 
it's good to put the kills on them again. That's good. See, if I had pawn, I would be able to just negate completely what the. Yeah, I I I sh I can totally see the value of pawn there. And uh, I should put one more kill stack on myself and then breeze. I'm not sure why I didn't do that, but now I should. Now I definitely have to use C. Come on, use C. Okay. Kill, kill myself. Okay, yeah. Okay, S grave guard. Okay. I'm glad I didn't grave guard there. That's good. Okay. Ah, uh, yes. Chased way too far. <laughs> I see that's a common mistake that the enemy is making every time they're chasing way too far. Grave guard? Okay. <laughs> I guess there wasn't a need to grave guard since he just used his E on me. That claymore. Yeah, I. Mm. See, stacking. I should be stacking like this. Bad positioning. Bad positioning. How did we get tree capped? <laughs> Must be a red capping somewhere. Ah, there. <laughs> yeah, exactly what he said. We're winning by kills, but we're losing by cap. <laughs> yes, okay, that's good. Now we are fully capped. Yes, that's a good thing. I shouldn't be staying close to the front line as much as I can. I only stay close to them when I need to go give the cues. But even so, I shouldn't be. I shouldn't be staying close to the front line, especially when the claymore is having such a good focus on me. As you can see throughout the game, the claymore has been trying his hardest to focus me. So. I think he's a he's doing a really good job. Mm. So all the more I should be playing more carefully. Yes, but I think that was a it's a bad thing to try to focus on just the healer because you're just giving yourself free damage. You're getting free damaged by the enemy team. So don't just think about focusing healer. More like just burden the healer until he can't heal anyone anymore because just damage the team in general damage the rdps because that's where the most of the damage will come from yes okay that's q good q continue queuing yeah okay try to follow the q pattern that's good Hmm, I shouldn't be walking in there. I definitely shouldn't be walking in there. The claymore is just beside. Okay, he's just. <laughs> yeah, yeah. He, if he didn't type there, he would have had time to just <laughs> hit a lot. He would have had time to get a lot of value on me, but he was typing that. Yeah, but uh, I shouldn't be walking there. <laughs> Especially since the claymore is there. <laughs> see? Yeah. Uh, yeah, see? Uh, that's what I mean by not going so close to the front line. And then there, I get punished. Okay, that's a good win then. Overall, not huge mistakes actually. Just positioning mistakes, but the ease and the grave guards were so much better. Alright, that's it for this video. Thanks for watching. If you enjoy such content, remember to hit the like and subscribe button. By the way, kudos to Nochul from Red Pack for teaching me healing. He helped me improve by mouse. Turn on your notification bells because more of such videos are coming up. Hope to see you guys in the next videos. See you